What's up, guys? Welcome to Nutero. I am an energy and intuitive reader, and I'm here to do the you versus the universe for somebody. So let's see. Libra, what's up, Libs? Thank you so much for being here. This message can resonate with you if you have Libra as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. All right. So this is a new segment that I'm doing. So please like this video if you want me to keep doing these. I'm basically going to see what you're doing versus what the universe suggests that you should do. You have free will, so you can always do what you want. You know what I'm saying? But I created this because I feel like it could give us some options or some clarity or confirmation on stuff. You could have Pisces in your chart or be dealing with the Pisces straight off the gate. You have the Magician in reverse, the Judgment in reverse, the Page of Wands, and the High Priestess in reverse with the Knight of Cups in reverse. <sighs> Libra. Lately, you've been in some energy. Or maybe you've been surrounded by some energy. I don't know. Take it how it resonates. <sighs> Do you know what you're doing? You're playing around. And I'm yeah, I'm gonna be the one to tell you. Or this could be a Pisces or someone near you that's doing this. But I ask what you're doing, and this is what you're doing. There's you're not you're del you're not making an important decision, and you're playing you're messing around with your manifestations. Like what you truly want cannot come in because you're diddly daggling. I don't know if that's a word. You're focused on wanting a new beginning and and wanting a fresh start, and like you, it, but it's like you're avoiding the elephant in the room. Yeah, it's like you're trying to, you're trying, it could be about a family or a friend here um, with the three of cups. You have the three of cups, seven of cups, and the nine of cups in reverse. You're trying to, like, it's like you're telling yourself things and you're, ma and you're making things seem like they're really not just so you could, like, move forward. Could be with that fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sag, but you know that that's not right. Like, you know it. Could be a work thing. You know it. All right, let's see. What does the universe have? Bottom of the deck is a strength card in reverse. Could be a Leo. Doesn't have to be though. You can have that in your chart. Four of Swords in reverse. Okay, so. Ooh. All right, so what they want you to do is they want you to nurture whatever this is. Point blank, period. They want you to get out of your head and they want you to think logically here. Okay, um, I feel like there's a lot of pain, there's a lot of disappointment here. I feel like they want you to, when I said they want you to nurture this, they want you to nurture yourself. Like, what is more important to you here? I feel like there is a lot of, it's like you want to start something new, but there's still some pain. There's still some disappointment. So it's like, it's like you, it's like you, how can I, I don't know how to put this. It's like you making your bed, but not removing the, the covers that were underneath. And you just put the new cover over the dirty cover like you know what i'm saying like you got to take off that the bottom layer to put on a brand new sheet you got to take out that old sheet to put on the new sheet it could be that you're trying to avoid some type of conversation here because you have the world the strength card in reverse and the seven of swords in reverse it's like this is gonna it's like this is um you're going to be you could be feeling really drained right now or like not have a lot of energy um, and I feel like it's because you need to speak up. There's something that you're hiding, something that you're not saying, and you need to speak up about it so that something could finalize. But I feel like there's something that you're not trying to look at and it's keeping you in your head and it's just causing pain and resentment. That's all that it's doing. And even though you're starting a new journey or even though you're starting a new, you know, 
a new level in whatever this is, there's still pain. There is still disappointment here. Like like they want you to realize that there there is still all of this here and you that can't be ignored. Like the universe will not allow you to ignore it and I feel like they're coming at your mind right now. And that's where it starts and then if and then if they can't get you in your mind, they're going to move over to the to the um I feel like they already hit you emotionally, but you're still going. So now it's going to be the mind. And if you still go with that, it's going to be your finances, your stability. You know what I'm saying? Like they're going to wake you up because this is not good for your soul, your spirit. There's pain here that has to be addressed before this can even move forward, before anything could happen. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they want you to close out a chapter, but I don't feel that's for all of you. So that's why I didn't say it. All right, Libra, that's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.